Hey what's up everybody I hope you all are doing absolutely fine this is Rudra Ditya and in this video I am going to talk about the new update of OnePlus Nord which is the Oxygen OS 10.5.10 and which we received after a long wait. Well we all are eagerly waiting for Android 11 update on the OnePlus Nord and whenever I will receive the Android 11 update I will try to quickly update all of you guys so stay tuned for that and make sure to subscribe my channel but for now on let's talk about the Oxygen OS 10.5.10 and there is a good news that this update definitely fix a lot of things especially the connectivity part and generally if you talk then OnePlus Nord has issues with the connectivity part only like Wi-Fi issues, mobile data issues and Bluetooth connectivity issues. So we will address all of them one by one so now without wasting any time let's start the video. Alright so first thing first let's talk about the free fire game now many users are complaining that they can't play this game on oneplus not with mobile data on with wi-fi there is no problem but with mobile data the gameplay all of the sudden freezes or is stuck at some point and then unfortunately you can't do anything but you just have to close the game which is very annoying so i try to play this game with mobile data on the new update and to be honest i just played for 15 to 20 minutes and i guess this issue is now fixed but if you are a pro gamer then i'm pretty much sure that you play this game for hours and then again you might face the same issue so please confirm this in the comment box that is the issue is still there with the new update or oneplus fix this but i guess oneplus fix this well many of you guys are facing connectivity issues with 2.4 gigahertz wi-fi but to be honest i never faced any wi-fi connectivity issues on 2.4 gigahertz or the 5 gigahertz channel so i guess this is not the problem for me but if you are facing this issue then with this update it might be solved so just update this and let me know that is the wi-fi issue for you the 2.4 gigahertz wi-fi issue is solved for you or not all right so one more good news is that now oneplus fix the bluetooth connectivity bug with this new update now i already faced the connectivity issue in 10.5.9 but now with this update i tried with plenty of earbuds and headphones the bluetooth headphones and bluetooth earphones and i haven't faced a problem with any of them by the way what about you guys is there still any issue that you are facing in your device even after the new update do let me know in the comment box and also let me know that what type of bugs were fixed with the new update on your device and feel free to ask anything if you have any doubt and also feel free to share anything which you know so well there is still one more issue i faced in the oneplus Nord with the new update is the refreshing your feed issue now whenever i try to refresh my feed with mobile data then the feed doesn't refresh but if i do the same process with wi-fi connectivity you can see the result by yourself see the page refresh so this is the issue which i am still facing in the new update well talking more than with this update you also get the security patch of december 2020 and i guess with android 11 you will get the security patch of january so we just have to wait little bit more and then we will get the update so but right now we are on december security patch well talking about the day to day performance then it is the same as it was on the previous update so there is not any difference and this time oneplus didn't give any camera updates so yeah we have to wait for the android 11 then we will check and talking about the battery then yeah you will get like six to seven hours of screen on time which is fine we can't say that battery is draining very highly or something like this it's fine but yeah Previously, we get 8-9 hours of a screen on time on 10.5.5 and 10.5.6. So compared to that, it's definitely a little bit less. But it is what it is. And that's it from today's video. I hope you guys like the content. If you, then smash the like button and share this video with your friends. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And also tap the bell icon. Select all to get all the notifications of my videos. Because there are a lot of videos will come related to OnePlus. So if you are a OnePlus user, definitely make sure to subscribe. And I will see you very soon in my next video. Until then, bye-bye. Take care.